from the donated uh, units that we got from international partners and Jamaicans. Uh, how many are working? How many are functional? And uh, we we got numbers like 118. We got 122. The official release, the first release, uh, accounted for 54. So the, the numbers were all over the place. And then when they finally did the, the complete audit, um, roughly half of the ventilators were not working. So the we, ones that came, you are suggesting broken ventilators came? No. As it, so what happened was that because they never had a maintenance plan in place, they didn't have spare parts. What they would do is a compressor is not working on one ventilator. They would raid another ventilator, take off that compressor and fix this one that's working. So they, they pretty much were cannibalizing parts. And that is what led to, uh, you know, roughly half of the ventilators just out of commission, missing parts, or just were never... Uh, be able to, to be used at all. When you said there, there is no maintenance plan, that should come from, from whom? Well, from us here are the folks who give it to us to be... Uh, we should see. Nobody gets equipment. Uh, if you're a businessman, you, you always have a preventative maintenance plan in place. Now, there's a unit at the Ministry of Health, the HFMU, that deals with maintenance. That unit, as far as I, I hear, has been gutted. And that is why we're having so many issues with equipment in hospitals from broken down monitors, x-ray equipment and ventilators. Now, um, that, that is a serious problem. It's almost as if we're using complex medical equipment as disposable to use them for a while and then throw them out. As far as you know, how many did we get and how many are in operation right now as we speak? Well, the, the last numbers came out at 210 in the system and operational I think it's about 120. Can we bear this out for me? Um, remained in boxes. I can't imagine that there will be ventilators here that are still in boxes. Yes. Reliably informed Can and I, um, in, the, it, in the count they, they did say that there were some like ventilators just, were never So there you go my people to hear what Dr. Daz is saying. And this is the thing we cast the old store of everything we are going in. You know. When you hear the labor right them come out to talk about the PMP, them are this and this and them are that. These are the problems that are happening in the country when people come out and voice them opinion about the ventilators and all of that. Look here again. Today again, another baby go to the Maypen hospital and had was to be transferred people. And the same thing we talk about, you know. And I eat a cast all the store. And them something across all this story that the Prime Minister will come out and go and talk about fake news and all of them something here, people. The be listen, me, listen. Health Minister Dr. Christopher Tufton has confirmed that the eleven month old baby who was in need of a ventilator at the Maypen Hospital in Clarendon has been transferred to the University Hospital of the West Indies for treatment. The mother of the of the infant, Yannick Chikori spoke with TV the news yesterday, pleading for assistance. That was yesterday. After the Mapen Hospital pediatric ward did not have a ventilator and the hospital had challenged securing her for a transfer and the mother had to come out and beg for help people again. And the minister come out and say, in the old Jamaican, nobody, no, 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 no. Uh, any one word we mean? You must go answer to the prime minister, to hell with on a Jamaican. I don't need to answer on to nothing. Eh? It is, un it is unacceptable. It is unacceptable. So I'm going to read some of the comments where the Jamaica people are saying, people, because this doesn't look good. So the PMP was speaking the truth. One that person said, oh, so a social media saved the child life. Oh, the same fake social media. Somebody else said, PMP attack showed. So after so much foolishness for the past few weeks, the ventilator situation and Mapen still not fixed. No, sir, so this not look good. Somebody said, great job, mother. Come out and make everybody know. And I hope for now and after when anybody have need like them, come out and speak publicly. Make people know the, the media, the media need to do better and tell 
and tell the minister to do better. Sorry, I read it wrong. The minister need to do better. Sorry. So if the mother then come out and cry out, there would be nothing done, my people. This is the present situation that the PMP is talking about. Dr. Alfred Das came out and was talking about it. And they make a mockery of it. When you look now, I am seeing where Babsy Grange saying the PMP must be civil in public discourse. As if uh, the PMP come out and I make trouble with them when you attack the truth. You understand the mess of my people? No, man. This is getting from bad to worse. I also hear not even gloves in some of the hospital them. Not even gloves in the hospital. People are use as garbage bag for take off things off of them. A happen. I don't have the audacity. I can talk about PMP at this and PMP at that. Eh? And people not for talk. I don't hunger PMP alone as struggle. I see one labor right guy put up one video on TikTok. I cry. Kind losing two, two matriarchs in their family because of a ventilator. And the people come out and speak about it. I don't take it. I turn it in all kind of something because I've been exposed. Huh? My viewers and my subscribers, I am sick and tired of them. I'm sick and tired of them. See there? Another baby again. Hospital not even have ambulance for child people for transfer them. Look how far me up in the from, from, from university and somebody has gas for little bread and can get little here. God almighty man. What 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 go on here? Eh? What's happening here? And the only paretric we are going with this thing. This is hell. This is people's life. This is people's life. And the minister come out and come chat one bag and nonsense. This is people's life, people. We need help. We need help. Viewers, we need help. Somebody come to the help and the rescue. Because we need help. If if an I show a YouTube the I just make a loud scream for help. But I can't make the scream. So I don't understand where it come from. We can't allow the we are talking about population are going if we if we if we continue at this rate here, we soon have a body left back. Yeah? So the tell from a view, leave on a comment, the conversation continue, another baby again. Gasping for air. Like, share, and subscribe. And the conversation continues. I'm your girl, Auntie Jenna. Catch you next time. Bye.